So in this video, I wanted to show you guys how we are setting up projects underneath workspaces here in Polyworks in V14. So right now I've just fired up Polyworks and I've got just a blank workspace open. But now I've done some work here. Let's go to the file, recent workspaces. I've got a client here I did some scanning for on some castings. And you can see underneath here now my, my project is open or my, my workspace is open. And here are the projects underneath that workspace. So each has got their own individual names. And you can see if I just click on them, it gives me kind of a preview window here of what uh, what is in there. The other thing is, too, I've got a comment here. Notice that it says three-piece sample. And those three pieces are the initial shots from their tooling. So you can add comments in here by just hitting this Edit button. But what I did want to show you guys is that here, if I fire up the Windows Explorer a second, Okay, underneath my client's drive, I've got a client landscape forms here. And remember in the, um, in the video that talked about the workspace, so here's the, the workspace name, this bollard leaf. So that's the main heading for the project, or for the workspace, I'm sorry. And you can see that it is quite small, 22K big. So I call this file the finger pointer. What it's doing is it's pointing the finger at this folder here, this bollard leaf underscore files. All the supporting stuff is going to show up underneath here. So let me back up again. But now notice, so it's only 22k big, very small. But if I right click on this folder here and look at the properties, check this out. That folder is about a gig and a half big. And I would expect that. All of my point clouds are underneath there. My reporting is, is um, underneath there. CAD files are all falling underneath there. So it is one stop shopping for all of the files needed for this workspace here. So it just points the finger at that folder there. So back over here now. But so if, if you wanted to start to add some projects to this, you can click on this project here, this I am inspect projects. You can right click and say create using I am inspect, or you can run up to this icon right here and start I am inspect. Either way, you can fire up a, a blank project and you can just start to measure, start to scan, do all your model prep inside of there. So I'll give that a second to fire up. And there you go. So now you've got an untitled project underneath this workspace known as the Bollard Leaf. So here if I wanted to do a quick file, save, project as, let's say that this is the long Bollard with the lock. So let's delete that out a second and save. So that project will now be saved and I'll go back over to the workspace screen. That will be showing up right here as my fourth project underneath this workspace. So pretty easy on how to, how to organize your files here and keep everything underneath this one workspace. And again, this is one family of parts, but personal preference on how you guys would like to organize your workspaces. I just thought this made sense here since all of those are about the same family. Okay.